and we come to you now with a quick request for support for our World Charity Fund. Well, good evening to you and welcome on this most perfect Hello, evening for a game of football to, to which we look forward immensely. It's hardly a surprise that everybody has come here in their droves, this being a fixture that has received so much coverage in the days leading up to it. And it's good to see that we have a good Everyone contingent of visiting fans by the look of it to too. The, the atmosphere is amicable, the conditions do bring out the best in everyone, and I think we're all looking forward to a feel-good game. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for and a game of this nature. Lining up for Arsenal. Oh, there are plenty looking forward Number to seeing six. this, a capacity crowd here. Oh, get ready for some high-grade football, three. Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful Number individual five. talent. And we have every Party. right to anticipate some Number really entertaining four. football. As to whether we'll see Shaka. a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining though because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface and that's a fine start in itself. There's the whistle. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? Some of the greatest who have played the game have described Frankie de Jong as a player who can define an era. The way he holds on to the ball, absorbs pressure, creates space. There's much more than a, a passing resemblance to some of the former greats. Well, he would be the obvious choice, wouldn't he? He certainly has all the right qualities. Dembele gets his pass away. Nice control. There's the ball. Chance for the header! Oh, just needed a better contact. I thought the wing work was A1. The defending and finishing was anything but. Not the best distribution from the keeper. And it's Aubameyang. And he's away. Aubameyang! <laughs> Keeper pulls up a fine save. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Now they can spring out of defence. Decent hit! Goal! Barcelona! Just so calm under pressure, and he managed to fashion a fine finish. Well, he had to deal with an awful lot of unwanted attention, but his tenacity won the day.
the goal scorer for Barcelona after 18 minutes is number 19 Duran Torres Barcelona take the lead. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. Well, the referee has made it pretty clear now that this is his last chance. Yeah, and he's just entered the last chance saloon. One wrong move now, and he's in trouble. The throw. That's good play. Granite Xhaka, chance to finish. And he's really put himself on the line here. with the clearance he's made space for the shot crosses it in Barcelona can counter properly here oh they could break here he might be in here no no way he was going to let him past Saka Odegaard Arsenal certainly could do with a positive spell for the remainder of this half, just to set the tone for what's to come. And the ball's come loose here. Oh, he's got that all wrong, and it's a penalty. And that is a huge moment in the context of the game. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. to square things up. He has missed it. Oh, Peter, I, I'm not a great reader of body language, but I didn't like the way he walked up to that. Plenty of appeals, but the referee is not interested. PK. Two added minutes has been indicated. We are into overtime. And it's PK. There's the whistle for half-time. So there you have it, a close-fought half of football, but one that still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Just a quick request today. Well, it hasn't exactly got the plan so far, but there's no need to panic. There's still the plenty of time to get back into this. As always, Everyone an early goal will help swing things back in their favour. Here we go again, then. Arsenal don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in the second half. They can't hold back, though. For Daniel Alves. Arsenal looking to get their possession game going here. Yeah, it can be very stylish and expansive to watch if they get it to the standard we know they can. But what's key is the number of ballers in the team. As long as they don't lose the purpose. If they keep the purpose and the urgency, all will be well. And the shot! Spread out to the left. Smith Rowe. The attendance for this match was 16,870. Jordi gets across to intercept that. He's left his man. 
Well, the defence proved infallible then, but that won't be the last they'll see of him. He's had a fair tumble under that challenge. Well, that's a foul. A simple decision for the referee. Odegaard, good spot, he's seen the run, now it's Saka, now there's a, f now the finish! And that has earned a few nods of approval from the bench. Have their second corner now. And he's there to clear it. And the whistle's gone, presumably for offside. Arsenal are definitely going about this the right way. This is a really front-footed approach. Well, the question now is whether they can sustain it. Talk about singling someone out. Well, they seem intent on marking them out of the game. They're certainly trying to wind them up in the process, Peter. Fiddles it through. Gets away from his opponents. Dembele. Barcelona clearly have been instructed to kill this off. Offence is the best form of defence. De Jong. Tierney. Dembele gets the better of his opponent and gets the ball. A real chance to break. Aubameyang was ultimately thwarted there, but it took a few of them to stop him. Oh, I was time. on the edge of my seat then. He just took on one too many. He's got space in the area. And that is that. Always in the balance, and in the end, one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. Your final thoughts, Jim? Well, the way the manager has stormed down the tunnel lends itself to an almighty telling off for such a, a timid, docile display. And all that remains for me is to thank Jim Beglin. That's it from us tonight. A very good evening Command to one and all. Please have your entry tickets at hand as it's time to announce today's winning lottery numbers.